Hey friends, don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't done so. So today as a part of this uh, lead code solution challenge, we are going to solve the 545 boundary, 545 number problem, which says a boundary of binary tree. So we are going to use JavaScript for this. And before that, I'll uh, let's read the problem. So herein we are giving the boundary of a binary tree. This is our binary tree. And the usually what I will do, I go with the example so if you see here we have a root node uh, and then so as the problem says the boundary would be like the concatenation of a root which is the one and it the one doesn't have a, a leaf node so we'll go with the three so basically the concatenation of a root left and then the leaves so so we are going uh, so we are going from one null so we are going from one three four and two and because the left boundary is empty uh, of course because the root does not have a left child and the right boundary follows the path starting from the roots the right child basically from two to four okay and four is a leaf uh, because it doesn't need, because it's the right boundary of um, node two and leaf is leaves are from left to right so leaves from which, are, which are from left to right three to four so we, after concatenating the results we get is one plus null null node plus three four uh, which is a which is the leaf node plus two and so it becomes one three four two so let's hover to the problem now uh, the solution now so one simple algorithm would be to divide this problem into three sub problems which is left boundary leaves and the right boundary so here in if you see this is a uh, i have a small uh, function which is uh, is leaf is true and we have like a result array as a, a b e okay so the what is the left boundary so basically we keep on traversing the tree towards the left and keep on adding the nodes into the result array provided that the current node isn't a leaf node if at any point we can't we can't find the left node which left child of a node but its right child exists so we will put we put the right child in the result array and continue the process the the the, the following animation will might help you so if you see uh, uh, the, uh, the the color from uh, from left from green uh, it, it it follows the path so the result boundary would be having like h i e and m okay and uh, leaf nodes like we are for leaf nodes we will be making use of a recursive function which we will in which we will change the root node for every recursive call if the current root node happens to be a leaf node it's automatically get added to the result array so else it will make a recursive call using the left child of the current node as the new new root okay now we will uh, after this we will make the recursive call using the right child of the current node as the new root so the, the the following animation will will help us like it will we have using a stack here and we have first put the uh, c and then the g and uh, so so in the in, in the result array we'll be having the leaves okay in the right boundary will be uh, for the right boundary what we will be doing we'll be performing the same process as the left boundary but this time we will traverse towards the right if the right child doesn't exist we move towards the left child also instead of putting the traverse nodes in the result array we push them to the stack during during the traversal so after the complete traversal is done we will pop the element uh, from from the stack and append them to the result array so uh, okay complexity analysis would be like for time complexity like it would be like an on because for one complete traversal for leaves and two traversals up to the depth of binary tree for the left and the right boundary and uh, space complexity would be on because we, we are using a result array and a stack array is used okay so let's move on to the solution so as you see here we'll move on to the code now and we'll read the existing one and we will uh, we have already written the code before <clears throat> so as our problem is like we have uh, this is our uh, JavaScript code for the boundary of binary tree. So wherein we have divided the problem into three sub problems. So basically, we are finding a right boundary, uh, a, a left boundary, 
and uh, a, a, a level boundary okay so in in this way so if you see here in the left boundary we keep on traversing towards the left okay in the in, in this in this left boundary portion of function so where and we keep on adding the nodes to the result array okay we are using the result dot push as uh, we are using like current value there okay and uh, and if at any point if the i mean if we can't find the left child of a node and if it has a right child which exists so we will put the right child into the result array and continue the process okay and for the leaf nodes we are making use of a recursive function in which we can in which we change the root node for every recursive call okay and uh, so if you see here uh, we are changing the root uh, we are changing uh, we, we change the root node for every recursive call and if the correct node happens to be a leaf node then we will we'll, we'll be adding it to the uh, result array and getting at we will be result, resulting we will returning the result okay so uh, having said that we also find the right boundary we uh, similar to like the left boundary we this but this time we traverse towards the right okay and if the if the right if the right child doesn't exist then we move towards the left okay and if you see like instead of putting the traverse nodes into the result array we put them into the stack so using like stack dot push okay uh, and then uh, once the traverse cell is to the stack is done we'll be uh, we'll be popping the element from over the stack and appending it to the result array so this is the way we will be uh, getting it and we'll be running the code now and we'll see how it goes yeah so we have a, our solution is accepted and is runtime is around 60 milliseconds which is uh, okay which is uh, uh, if not bad and the time complexity as you mentioned is uh, one complete traversal for two leaves and two traversals up to the depth of binary tree for left and sub right boundary so it should be o of n and so space complexity as well for o n o n because we are using two two arrays res result array and uh, stack array so hope you have liked this video or don't forget to subscribe to this channel tkd health tips if you like the video like share and comment and thank you you have a good day stay safe stay healthy